Hi everyone, I'm Luca Invernizzi, Lynx Eli, Oxy Eli, and today we are here because I want to introduce you the Oxy 4. The Oxy 4 uh, is a project that started uh, around uh, two years ago after the Oxy 3. We tried to make a Deoxy 4 using most of the part of the Oxy 3, but test after test we discovered that the, the power and the performance request for a Oxy 4 um, cannot match with the Oxy 3. Then uh, we decided to stop everything and uh, we start a new completely project. I started to work with my consultant, uh, mathematical consultant in Italy, uh, Luca Orsini. And uh, after one month of meeting and uh, test and simulation in computer, we, uh, we finally come with a, a new design. And uh, then we start to make a sample and we work with uh, Rasmus and my friend Rasmus that uh, thanks to his uh, um, feeling, uh, fly feeling, very, very precise and uh, an accurate report, we change uh, and we uh, modify uh, the, 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 the first design Oxy4 and then now here I can present you the final Oxy4. About the design of Oxy4, let me explain you something. Uh, thanks to the experience of uh, Oxy2, Oxy3 and uh, all the comment, uh, uh, positive and negative for sure, that uh, we uh, listen from our customer and our pilot, when uh, we uh, design the Oxy4, we don't uh, only uh, think about performance, sure, Oxy is a performance. Oxy Ailey, uh, it, it, every kit Oxy Ailey must give a feeling, good feeling when we fly from novice uh, because of precision and quality and uh, up to the top pilot, they, they really need uh, the crazy machine. Uh, then when uh, we, uh, we start working in Oxy4, we decide not only to have uh, the best performance, uh, we also work in aesthetics. We try, uh, you know, I'm from Italy and uh, in Italy we like uh, the things, uh, style, design, then I, I try my best uh, and also with some uh, uh, support, some friend, a consultant, to try to find uh, the shapes, uh, the canopy, the new shape of the canopy, uh, the color, the finish of the parts, the design of every single part, the new shape of the frame. Uh, the new transition between frame and boom, uh, the new tail design, everything now in the Oxy4, uh, I feel and I see, and then I see the face of my friend when they see the kid the first time, they really like uh, not only in fly, but also they like uh, the aesthetics. And this I think is very important right now, because right now uh, the market is changing and people not only focus in performance, now everything must be perfect and also very nice. Let me say, must be a sexy Ailey. Uh, the Oxy4 in uh, the standard uh, configuration uh, fly uh, 300, uh, 325mm blade, but uh, uh, thanks to the stretch boom, uh, tail boom, uh, the Oxy4 can go up to 360, then uh, 350, 360. Um, we have a different uh, tail blade uh, and, dif and different uh, tail radio, uh, pull it, then uh, it's easy, it's easy to change the ratio and uh, transform uh, a machine, the same machine from 325 up to 350. Uh, about uh, the, the canopy, uh, like I explained you before, we really uh, try to make a different and nice shape. Then uh, we, uh, we have a big volume, uh, big volume for the battery, for sure, to have a more uh, space for different kind of battery. Uh, to uh, 3S uh, 2200 up to 1100 uh, 6S. Um, and uh, like you can see now the canopy it's very aggressive, very um, very special design, have a very nice uh, I believe and then uh, confirmed by people the, the shape have a fusion of uh, soft surface with a sharp edge. This is making the canopy very aggressive and uh, very nice looking. Uh, about uh, the, the construction, the kit is made uh, uh, mostly in uh, aluminum CNC, carbon fiber frame, 
Uh, we have uh, some uh, technopolymer part injected because uh, our experience now uh, teach that some part uh, uh, actually works better uh, for wear and uh, for crash resistant where uh, work better if uh, we use a technopolymer then uh, some part in the head like the FC rod or in the tail uh, some uh, part are technopolymer but again uh, we we tested very well and then our experience confirmed that the helicopter fly better and uh, it can uh, it can be more strong in case of crash about uh, about the electronics <clears throat> the oxy4 is a 450 size eddy then uh, when uh, we design the helicopter for sure we keep the standard then about servo uh, for sure is a micro servo in the cyclic uh, also micro servo in the tail works very well um, oxy every oxy also oxy4 have a special geometry in the tail uh, special weighted uh, tail grip uh, and um, then the composition of the design and uh, all oxy uh, detail uh, make the tail uh, the tail mechanical gain pretty high then uh, no, and, and then uh, no need a very high torque servo in the tail uh, because uh, the system detail assure a very low load at uh, at any head speed then we test for sure the mini the kit uh, have a predisposition uh, for use mini tail servo but honestly we decide to our pilot decide to go with the mini because it's lighter and then in the end fly the same. Um, about the landing gear, uh, the landing gear we keep uh, the same uh, concept of Oxy 2, uh, means that we have a double skid, then uh, in case of crash uh, the skid can easily disengage and this one uh, uh, after uh, all our tests uh, really confirmed that uh, when the landing gear can easily disengage in case of crash the frame uh, survive better uh, and have less damage.